It is once again time for another video update. Now we know we're terrible at keeping up with this channel. So this time we want to give you guys a heads up. We're going to be taking a break for a few weeks. No big deal. Hopefully when we come back, we can get everything rolling again. But for right now, we want you guys to leave us your feedback. Let us know everything that you like about the MTO more reviews, everything that you hate about us, what you would like us to do in the future, all of that stuff. That way we can know what direction to take this channel when we come back. In the description, you're gonna find a list of all of our video series, and we'd like you guys to copy and paste that list and rate each of those videos from a one to a 10 based off how interested you are in that series. This will help us figure out what we should focus our energy on when we come back and what we can put on the back burner. Now we've been wanting to kind of start to take this channel away from wrestling for a while, especially since the future of wrestling looks pretty bad. Even the all important woman's wrestling evolution is nothing more than filler at the moment. You know how they're protecting Sasha Banks by keeping her off of TV until they give her the title at SummerSlam? They might as well just do that with the entire division right now rather than waste our time because that's all they're doing right now is wasting time. And they know that they're wasting time, which is why they aren't putting Sasha Banks on TV, because they know that it's more beneficial for her to stay out of the spotlight rather than to be wasted on filler on the main show. And that's the thing, is that WWE is going through all this trouble for the benefit of two people. Everything that they're doing to create this idea that they're making women's wrestling relevant is nothing more than an illusion to make Charlotte and Sasha Banks look like stars. That's why they're going through all this trouble to make these improvements like changing the title and handing them all these accomplishments. It's not that they're doing that to benefit the division, they're doing that so they can give those handful of women all the credit for all the improvements in the division. They're not trying to make women's wrestling relevant, they're trying to make a handful of women in wrestling relevant. You know, WWE has done a lot since WrestleMania to try to give the IWC what they want. But now, not only are they driving away casual fans as a result, but the IWC still hates the show now more than ever. So all WWE has managed to do is piss off all of their fans. Omar has been saying it for weeks, but WWE listening to the Smarks is the worst thing that they can do because these people only have one mindset, and that's, I want all my favorites in the main event, and I won't accept anything else. They're narrow-minded, they're stubborn, they're petty, they're ignorant, and they're devoid of any logic. So WWE is making a mistake by fueling them on and feeding their egos by letting them dictate history. They even had Michael Cole take a post from Reddit he said that Charlotte was the first woman to wrestle 11 straight pay-per-views, even though that was false information. Nikki was on 12 straight pay-per-views during her title reign, and they never mentioned anything about that. It's just ridiculous how much credibility WWE is giving the dirt sheets nowadays. So if that's the direction that WWE is going to be going in, catering to that hive mind and the worst, most self-entitled fans on the planet, it's not going to do them any good. Vince Russo actually made the best point about this, and that's that they're catering to an audience that they're never going to lose. An audience that overestimates their importance, and an audience that represents the opposite of what they should do. But I just wanted to get that rant out of the way. Anyway, be sure to give us your feedback and let us know what direction you want this channel to go in in the future, and hopefully we can get everything rolling again when we come back.